Hey guys, it's Chief from Spreadshot Games. Finally back, gonna make a quick video, and this is gonna be a response to my good friend Ken 16 bit on what are our three favorite genres of video games. Stay tuned. <laughs> So, it should be no surprise that the first one I'm going to throw out is uh, first-person shooters. I love first-person shooters. Uh, as much as some people might think they're crappy, I think there's a lot of diversity in first-person shooters. Um, huge fan of Halo. Really like Left 4 Dead. I mean, just going through the, all these first-person shooters. Dishonored. Halo Anniversary. So, a lot of my collection, especially my modern games, are first-person shooters. Uh, I just think there's a lot to be told in first-person shooters. Um, you know, Dishonored really has a story and everything that's really nice, but one of my favorite genres that I think really uh, breaks the mold of your typical first-person shooter is this franchise right here. Bioshock. This is the collector's edition of Bioshock 2. I really, really like the Bioshock series. So, as much as people want to think it's just a lot of military, this, that, and all the other, um, I, I kind of take it for more than, uh, more than that. So, I'm really a big fan of first-person shooters. I think next, I'd probably say... Like, action platformers are probably my favorite. Platformers are kind of what I grew up with console-wise. Crash Bandicoot, Spyro the Dragon, stuff like that. Uh, Retro-wise, action platformers have got to be my favorite games. Stuff like Contra, Mega Man X, um, you know, Wild Guns, games like that. Uh, it's all about just jumping and shooting. So... You know, going back to more retro stuff, I think that's what I like the most out of them is, like, action platformers. And then, lastly, I'd have to say action-adventure games have to be uh, my number three. Not necessarily. I think we look at action-adventure now as, like, God of War, Devil May Cry, Uncharted, and I don't play those game series that much at all. I consider Action Adventure to be stuff. Uh, Red Dead Redemption is one of the best games I think I've played on the 360 era of games. I really like Red Dead Redemption. Uh, Grand Theft Auto, you know, games like that, those open world kind of sandbox games. I think I'd call them like Action Adventure. I'm not a huge Grand Theft Auto fan, but they're, they're okay. Uh, games like Skyrim. I would consider to be kind of an action adventure. Like, yeah, they're an RPG, but they're very they're very action based. Uh, even games like Mass Effect, I would go out on a limb and say action adventure. I know a lot of people call those RPGs. They definitely have RPG elements. In fact, I think RPG elements are coming into every genre of games. Uh, you know, there's almost no game out there now where I mean, there are games out there that don't have this stuff, but there's a lot of, like, leveling up, where you can level your weapons, or level your character, or learn new abilities as you progress through the game. You know, that's all stuff that comes from RPGs, so I guess you could call it action RPG, action adventure. Games like that have got to be my number, my number three. I really enjoy games like Skyrim. I mean, I could own an Xbox and just own this game and be perfectly content. But I'm really, I'm really big into, I guess, action games, games where you get to do a lot of stuff. Um, I like all games. Any game, like, I remember when I first started getting into games, I was asked a similar question. It was like, what kind of games do you like to play? And I just answered back then, good ones. And that still holds true. Any game that, you know, no matter what genre it is, if they say, you know, this game is really worth picking up, uh, I tried to look into it. I'm, I'm not made of money, but um, there's all kinds of cool games. I'll play anything and stuff. I'm not, you know, very good at some games. I know, like, Ken, he had uh, fighting games in his list, and I fucking suck at fighting games. But uh, I 
I really like Mortal Kombat. I had Mortal Kombat 3 as one of my first games on PlayStation when I was a kid, so I really like Mortal Kombat, but, you know, if, it, if, it's a, if it's worth picking up, I'll definitely check it out, but out of, you know, what I personally play at home, a lot of, a lot of first-person shooters, uh, a lot of, like, action-adventure type games, but... I hope to see some other people's lists and stuff like that. Ken, thanks for making this list, and uh, stick around because i got a question for you guys all. See you guys later.